Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very fun and exciting video for you guys because it's going to be on one of my favorite brands, Estee Lauder. And so if you want to see what I got and accumulated these past couple months, then please stay tuned, keep on watching, give me a um, thumbs up if you like this video and also subscribe for more videos. And yeah, so let's get on with the video and hope to see you soon. So before we get into the product, I just wanted to um, share with you of how I got into Estee Lauder, actually my family, um, my sister and my mom used to use Estee Lauder a long time ago, so I see like, you know, the Estee Lauder logos and bottles all around the house, but um, the reason why I started using Estee Lauder is because um, I had a massive breakout a long time ago. It was uh, maybe my freshman going into my sophomore year of college, and so I just had this massive breakout and I didn't know what to do, so I, you know, read in a magazine that Estee Lauder was pretty much the top of the line skincare, <laughs> so um, I, um, went to a counter and then started out with, you know, a certain skincare item and then after that it just blew up ever since. I love the brand. Um, I always accumulate, you know, uh, different items that release. Um, I just love the brand in general and also I used to work for them and so I worked for them for about, I think, three years or two and a half years, I don't remember. But yeah, so I worked for them and um, of course I don't work for them anymore. It's been like maybe three or four years since I've worked for Estee Lauder, but um, even though after I left, I still use Estee Lauder products just because I really believe in the products. Um, the products work very well for me and also work very well for my friends and family, so that's why I'm so passionate about it. And as proof that I work for Estee Lauder, I got this book right here called Estee, A Success Story by Estee Lauder. It's basically an autobiography about her and how she got into the business, how she gotten successful. It's just a really inspiring story. And this is the back right here. It's a really um, beautiful book. Now, I don't know if this is still going on, but if you were for Estee Lauder for one year, you get this book sent to you for free so you can get inspired as well. And then actually, um, I don't know, it was last year, I'm pretty sure it was last year, but last year in October, I went to Nordstrom for a trend show there, and Aaron Lauder was there. I was personally invited by my executive who used to um, be, be my boss back then, and she invited me to this event, and I got to meet Aaron Lauder, and then also I'll put a little picture right here or right here somewhere um, that I met her as proof, and so she was very nice, she was, um, you know, very, um, classy, how the way she talks, it's um, it's very, you know, uh, mature, and she just have like this um, really awesome class to her. I would say almost royalty, <laughs> so she was really amazing, and also, um, I bought this book to um, the trend show, and then she automatically knew what the book is, and then she was really happy that she saw it, and um, of course, I got her to sign it, and this is um, her signature right here. It's um, A for Erin with a heart right here. So I don't know if you could see that. Um, so yeah, so yeah, so that's basically it, you guys. Um, it's um, my little intro about Estee Lauder. I hope you guys like it, and I hope you guys really like the product. So let's get on with the products. Okay, so I wanted to start off by showing you the product, um, the very first product that I bought at Estee Lauder, and it's the um, Estee Lauder um, Idealist right here. Um, technically, this is not what I bought a couple months ago. I um, uh, have have this for a while now, but I just wanted to show you what um, was the very first um, Estee Lauder product that I got, and this is the item right here. I always have to have this item. It just really minimizes my pores, cleans out my pores, it also makes my face very flawless, and it really helped with my acne back then. It just really opened up all the pores and just cleaned everything out. So this is my, pretty much my savior right here. So I always have to have this, and I always have to have backups of it. Okay, so here's one of the items that I always use at Estee Lauder, and this is called the Renew Trib um, Intensive um, Smoothing Body Cream right here. The reason why I really love this body cream is that um, it really does hydrate my skin. It makes it feel really plump and really hydrated. I like to use it right after I get out of the shower when my skin is still damp. It really absorbs nicely. It smells really good. I um, I don't think it has like a fragrance, but I think everything has a fragrance. So um, it smells really nice. It's very soothing, and I just really love this product right here. And um, if you guys haven't really looked into um, Estee Lauder Renew Trip, Renew Trip is basically Estee Lauder's more luxurious line, top of the line. So everything you get at Renew Trip is going to 
be um, definitely worth your money. All this technology has put into it is amazing. It's basically the only skincare that I use right now, and so I really love the Renutrafine. So yeah, if you need a new body cream to really plump up your skin and also really give the nice, beautiful um, sheen and glow to your skin as well, so check out um, this body cream right here, and it's called the um, Intensive Soothing Body Cream um, by Estee Lauder, and it's in the Renutrif line. Next, I got the um, Renutrif um, Ultimate Lift Age Correcting Mask, and I've never used this before. I actually went to an Estee Lauder spa event a couple months ago, and um, uh, the um, specialist used this on my skin, and oh my goodness, it just really changed my skin. It really lifts up the skin, gives a lot more radiance and plump to it, because um, I remember um, that day, I like you know had like a really bad breakout on my skin. It was uh, very inflamed, so it was very red, but after she used this on my my skin it calmed down it really lifts up my skin it really contour my skin and I absolutely love it so I had to pick up one next I also replenish on my most favorite eye cream in the whole entire world and it is the renew trip um, ultimate lift age correcting eye cream and it comes in this beautiful box right here um, so this is basically what the product looks like um, comes in like a really beautiful like velvet um, case but anyway so this eye cream right here it is really great for contouring around the eyes really brightening the eyes really um what is it giving more hydration around the eye area i remember the very first time i used this maybe like four years ago my eyes were really tight um it just really lifts up my eyes i actually felt it working the first time i um i used it so if you um are on the market for a new eye cream i highly recommend this this is probably the only eye cream that i will ever use <laughs> for the rest of my life it, it, it is an amazing eye cream right here and also this eye cream came with this um beautiful case right here and this set actually comes with a smaller um sample of the eye cream and then also the um toner right here as well and uh, usually this is like a seasonal um holiday item so my store happened to have a couple left so i got it um because you know it's um and i feel like um what is the i think these are like free and then the case is free and then also the um eye cream of course you buy so you you buy the full price of the eye cream, and then you get these two basically for free, I think. Um, if it's not for free, then I, it's just a couple more dollars extra. But yeah, so this is what I got as for eye cream. Okay, so you know, a couple months ago, I actually had a um, another acne breakout, and then, you know, it's very miserable, so I just wanted to try um, Estee Lauder's um, acne line, and I've actually tried it before. I really, really liked it, so I decided to pick it up again. And so the item is the um, Estee Lauder Clear Difference um, Advanced blemish serum right here and um basically um this has i think um 0.5 percent salicylic acid so it um it does help with acne but it's not very you know to the point where like it dries out your skin and so yeah so it is um it is a really good product i actually really really like it now uh, to tell you the difference between these two because these two products help me with my acne now um this right here i like to use um in the morning um, before my makeup because it really pretty much like primes my skin up really nicely it closes up my pores very nicely and I use this at night time to kind of like have like that you know nighttime treatment for acne so this is how I in incorporate uh, these two products right here and then when I don't break out anymore I um, I stop using this product but I still use this product in the morning so today I went to the Estee Lauder counter and just let me tell you I go to the Estee Lauder counter like every week it's like a, um, a ritual for me but um, my uh, sales associate she always let me know when new things come in so she um, showed me this item this is the Estee Lauder um, advanced night repair intensive recovery ampules right here and uh, this is really different I actually haven't really seen um, this product before and I was really interested so I decided to just pick it up anyways because I love the advanced night repair line and so Oh, yeah so let me show you what the um, packaging looks like okay so this is what the packaging looks like right here it is very beautiful it's made of glass as a lot of products always have like the most gorgeous packaging so you just twist it open and uh, it has this um, little cap right here and then uh, yeah it's like these little amples right here these capsule where um, I think you uh, break off you know the top and then like the um the product comes out and then you just uh, apply it onto your skin she said that you use um this um i think after your serum so you would you know wash your face you, you use your toner you use your serum you would um put some 
this um, product on and then after that you would put your moisturizer on top and I think she said use this at night so you, you use this at night time and then it's going to uh, um, really what is it so it's going to really um, hydrate your skin it's gonna brighten it up it's going to de-stress your skin so this is a really good product for anyone who um, is always stressed <laughs> and um, and is um, around a lot of environmental assaults, uh, you know, like smoke pollution, smoking, this product is really going to help your skin. I'm going to try it for myself and then I will do a review for you um, a couple months down. Another product that I got today along with the Advanced Night Repair Ampules is the um, Estee Lauder Revitalizing Supreme Plus Global Anti-Aging Wake Up Balm right here. And I thought this was pretty unique and so I decided to get it as well. Well, so let's see what the packaging looks like. So this is what the packaging looks like. It looks really, really, really nice. And yeah, so basically what this product is, is you can basically use this anytime you want during the day for the, and the nighttime when you want like a boost of radiance and hydration. And also it says right here, the product helps with, um, you know, the firmness of your skin, gives more density, gives more elasticity, and dramatically reduce the look of lines and wrinkles. So it is... A great product I guess um, I haven't used it yet and um, so I will use this product and then I will let you know down the month how I think about it okay so I think that is it for skincare so now let's move on to makeup and fragrances as for makeup let's start with them um, eyeliners and um, I haven't used them um, Estee Lauder's newest eyeliner yet I've used their uh, double wear eyeliner that you um, sharpen but I haven't used these um, awesome new twist up ones and I got three colors right here um, I got black and sapphire um, it's one of them the other one is black and emerald and the third one I got is royal amethyst right here and the um, twist up eyeliner has like um, like a smudger at the end right here which is pretty cool and yeah so it's pretty much your um typical twist up eyeliners where oh i broke it <laughs> so you basically t twist up the product right there and then yeah you don't have to sharpen and oh my goodness horrible bad at myself so when you open this be careful don't rip off the tip <laughs> Next, I got the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation, and if you guys use Estee Lauder, you guys know that Estee Lauder's um, most best-selling foundation is the Double Wear Foundation right here, and uh, when I was in college, I would use this religiously every day. It is amazing. It is um, sweat and water resistant. It really stays on your skin. It dries down to a semi-matte finish, I believe, and also, um, it is, um, it's not cakey at all like you know it's um a medium to full coverage but um it is definitely not cakey it goes on really smooth it's really nice it's like a cult favorite amongst a lot of um beauty gurus so um i really highly recommend this foundation i absolutely love it i um, i just wish that it came in a pump but if you what is it want a pump on this product just go buy a mac pump and then just cut the bottom of it just a little bit maybe like a quarter of an inch or so like very tiny um, and then you can uh, fit the um, pump on top of this um, a double wear foundation bottle right here and then yeah so uh, I, I've used this for uh, a long 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 time now and so um, I decided to pick another one up so since we're on the topic of foundation, so this is um, the foundation that um, I am uh, used to use and well, of course I still use but now I actually prefer more the uh, maximum cover right here and I actually have the maximum cover on my skin right now because it just films really nicely. Basically um, the maximum cover is the more intense version of the double wear so this is um, medium to full coverage, this is straight on full coverage right here so uh, yeah you get to uh, pick and choose um, I love both of them this is a really good day for uh, I mean not a good day but this is a really good foundation for um, days where like you know I just want like you know I guess not as intense coverage and <laughs> I use this for days where I just really want um, intense coverage and if I have like you know an acne breakout or cystic acne I use this right here it covers up every single redness like it pretty much mutes all redness on my skin so I highly recommend these two foundations right here next I also got a new bronzer and it's the Estee Lauder bronze goddess bronzer right here and it's just you know a really big bronzer and I got the color in medium the bronzer comes with a nice brush right here where you can travel with and this is the color 
3 here. It's a really nice um, color for me. I, I really like it. It has like a very small amount of shimmer in it, but I love shimmer in my bronzer. So yeah, so this is um, my new bronzer. I'm actually wearing it right now. I'm not sure if you can tell because the lights are like pretty much washing my face out right now, but yeah, so um, I really love this bronzer right here. Next, I got a blush, and this is um, the Estee Lauder Pure Color um, Envy Sculpting uh, Blush, and this is the color um, Poppy Passion right here. I just really love their uh, packaging. They uh, recently just um, designed all of their makeup to um, kind of match their um, Envy line, th their Pure Color Envy line. So, uh, this is what the color looks like. It's like a nice, um, deep, um, kind of like burnt red color. I actually have it on my cheeks right now. I have it on really lightly because these blushes are so pigmented. So you only have to tap your brush on here and then after that you just put it on your skin. But this is what the color looks like and it has like a nice little brush right here to um, travel with. So yeah, poppy passion. Next you guys uh, know that I love my lip products, my lip glosses, my lipsticks. So I um, decided to get um, three of their uh, newest um, lip glosses and this is also from the uh, Pure Color Envy line. So this uh, first color right here, this beautiful coral color is called um, Jealous Blush. The um, middle color right here, um, it's like nudish color, is called um, Plum Impulse. And then this last beautiful pink color that matches my shirt is called Passionate Fuchsia right here. And I have used, um, what is that, Plum Impulse a couple times now and I really love the formula. It is not sticky at all, but it's a little bit thicker than their um, original um, Pure Color Lip Gloss. Um, line. So um, I absolutely really love it. It smells really nice. It's definitely not sticky. Um, it's also very pigmented. These glosses are pretty pigmented for lip glosses. So I am really impressed at Stay Lauder. So yeah, so this is the uh, three lip glosses that I got. So the next item are items that Estee Lauder have never came out with before. So these are brand new and these are the Pure Color um, Envy Lip Potions right here. So the best way that I could describe these items for you guys is that they're basically a liquid lipstick but a semi-matte liquid lipstick. So it's basically like a liquid lipstick but it's not as matte and it's hydrating <laughs> so so yeah so these are the um colors right here so let me show you what colors i got so i'm not gonna do swatches on these colors because i'm gonna have a separate video on swatches of the uh, liquid lip potion but the first color is called naked ambition it's a really nice brownish nude color great for every day next color is called pierce petal right here and it's a really nice lilac barbie pink type of color Next we got Wicked Sweet and this is like a um, coral pink color so great for summer. Then we have Cold Fire right here. This is like a coral color with a hint of red so also great for summer. Then I got another a nude color and then this is called Extreme Nude right here. It's a really great everyday color as well. And last I got this really nice deep vampy purple color and this color is called Savage Garden. So as for the lipsticks today, um, I got uh, one Pure Color Envy and then one Pure Color Envy Shine. So basically the Pure Color Envy is um, the original one and the Shine is just like a more sheer version of it. So let's see the colors. Okay, so for the Pure Color lipstick, I got this color. It's called Eccentric and it's a really nice like coral pink color. I've never um, used this one before, but I did swatch it in the store. It's a really nice, beautiful pink color with a hint of coral in it. It's also very great for summer. Next for the Pure Color Envy Shine um, lipstick, I got um, the color Surreal Sun right here. And I have not used this one yet, but I did swatch it in the store. It really gives a nice glossy um, coral color on your lips. It's a really great color for summer as well. Okay, so next let's move on to fragrances. Okay, for fragrances, I just wanted to show you um, one of their newest um, fragrance that they have. And this is called the Estee Lauder Modern Muse Le Rouge right here. And I actually got this set because um, it comes with like, you know, the perfume, the smaller version, and the lotion. And of course, look at the beautiful box. The presentation is awesome. So this is what the presentation looks like. It comes with a smaller version of the Modern Muse Le Rouge, the Le Rouge perfume, and then also the body lotion. You have the body lotion as well. Um, I really, really like this fragrance because it has a hint of rose in it and you know I love rose scent so I'm really bad at describing scent so if you want to know what the scent smells like please go to your Estee Lauder counter and smell it um, because I am so bad at describing scent 
all I can say is it smells good and it smells like roses. So, uh, yeah, so if you uh, visit your counter, then go ahead and, um, you know, take a sample. Sniff and see what you think. Next, I got um, Estee Lauder Pleasures Bloom, and then unfortunately this perfume is discontinued, but I really, really loved it. This is actually my second bottle. It's discontinued, but I actually found this at my local TJ Maxx. So, um, you know, I found it at TJ Maxx. I'm like, oh my goodness, I have to have it. So I got Pleasures Bloom. It's a, it's a really great scent. It's very uh, lightweight. It's very sweet. It's great for spring and summer. I absolutely love it. So I'm just going to use this very sparingly because I don't want it to run out. Next, I got some um, Aaron perfume and uh, this one is called Lilac Path, and this one is called Rose de Gras right here. And uh, these are from the um, Aaron line. Um, so um, they have their Estee Lauder um, brand, and then the Estee Lauder brand have uh, the Aaron brand, which is um, created by um, her granddaughter, Aaron Lauder. And so uh, these perfumes are awesome. They're very unique. They're very feminine. They're really playful. I absolutely really love them. So I'm just gonna basically quickly describe to you what I think uh, on these. Uh, um, this basically smells like lilac lilac path I know it's not helpful but it smells like lilac and um, rose de gras right here it's a really nice classy sophisticated rose scent so this smells very luxurious so if you want to treat yourself to a very luxurious perfume um, I highly recommend this one this one is life right here it smells so good so yeah so but um, to be honest all of Aaron's perfume smells really really great the packaging is really beautiful so I highly re recommend you uh, going and trying them out for yourself okay so we're on to the last two items right here I know this video is long so thank you you guys so much for um, bearing with me until now so um, I got um, the Aaron Lauder Rose Hand and Body Cream and then this is the uh, Rose Lip Conditioner right here and uh, yeah so again I love roses these products are amazing this hand cream body cream is really hydrating it smells really good and also this um, lip balm right here is also really hydrating and great too for my lips and it really gives like a really nice um, light pink hint of color on the lips so I uh, love this item right here I use this before I go to bed because you know I want to cherish it <laughs> so I only use this when I go to bed so yeah amazing amazing product so highly recommend you checking it out okay you guys so that concludes my video on my um, Estee Lauder haul that I have accumulated um, for a couple months now which I was supposed to do a video of but I didn't have time so I condensed it to one so I hope you guys really like this video I hope you guys found some products that you guys um, like and uh, is interested in trying so if you have any other Estee Lauder products that you guys love please leave in the comments down below because I would really love to um, read your comments and try them out for myself if I haven't um, used them already and so uh, once again I just want to thank you so much for supporting my channel and um, you know watching my videos following me on Instagram following me on snapchat and also Twitter I would like to really thank you and I just wanted to say that you know um, all of you are beautiful um, just you know keep on um, being positive, keep on smiling. Um, if you smile, you'll be so much more happier. And I just wanted to say that what you put into the universe, you get back. So kind of like karma. So if you put goodness in the universe, then the universe will give you um, back um, the goodness like 10 times more. So um, so always be positive. And what Estee Lauder always say, every woman can be beautiful and so remember that enjoy your day and once again hope you guys like this video and until next time i'll talk to you guys later and you know stay beautiful smile and be happy talk to you guys later bye